Alright, it's time for this thingy. This will be my first crawler of any kind. As you can see, it's got some pretty nice stuff on it. I mean, the wheels and tires alone are worth more than the entire truck. <coughs> it's pretty nice though. It's, uh, I believe, an Exceed Mad Torque weight scale. And the thing I like most about it is it's not green or blue. It's all this silver stuff. I like the color. Green is cool, hence, but just a little bit. <clears throat> this thing I don't know about yet. Had dual steering servos on when I got it. They had some major issues. So, swapped out for this little guy. I think it's a Tower Pro. Yeah. Oh, MG958 is a pretty good servo. I got a few of them. <coughs> I mean, they're not the strongest and they're not the fastest, but they're pretty good. They are kind of slow at centering sometimes, so if it's like for uh, nitro throttle, not a huge deal, but you do want it to stop. So, fire this bad boy up here in a second. It does have one of those AVC receivers in it, which I didn't know nothing about those until last night. Did some research and figured out how to program the one in this truck and program this one. Um, I don't know much about anything else on it. It's got a, I believe it's a RC4 wheel drive, 320 amp dual motor. Speed control comes with that BEC, it's all one unit. Um, it's pretty nice. It's got the RC four wheel drive uh, wheels and tires, these are aluminum. I don't remember what they call them, but they're like a hundred bucks a pop. Well, for two wheels and the hubs, fancy little hubs inside, <coughs> and the tires. I don't know, they're Mickey Thompson uh, Baja MTZs, huge, huge tires. Bigger than these uh, mud slingers, so and they actually feel a lot lighter than these guys. This one over here has the Mickey Thompson or Dick Cepec wheels on it. <coughs> these are plastic, and these are all aluminum. And these things weigh less than these ones do. It's crazy. I might have to do some wheel swap and tire swap, but anyways, shut up and drive. See how this thing does. All I got is dirt out here. I ain't got no rocks. I'm gonna have to find some rocks somewhere else. But for now, dirt will have to suffice. <coughs> yeah, that works much better than those other ones. Had a couple high tech uh, HS646 waterproof servos and I think they were pretty much fried. I don't think <clears throat> the guy that set it up had them synced right and uh, they ended up burning themselves out basically. They wouldn't center and if they did it would take them forever. They wouldn't um, go all the way one direction and then go all the way to the next direction. Just problem after problem. So Hopefully this, this one solves the problem. <coughs> Bad, you? Yep. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. They're addicting too. <laughs> oh, yeah. Especially with kids, they love them. <clears throat> what kind do you run? Uh, e Revo. Oh yeah, I got a couple of each of those. Those are fun. Pretty fast though. So. Must be like a crawler. Huh? That's what they call it. I don't know that it's much of a crawler. It's the first one I ever had, but ginormous tires help it out a lot. So we'll find out. I got to find some rocks, but here today will work. Yep. 
It's a lot cheaper than a car or a motorcycle. <laughs> you wreck those, it's you know twenty bucks to fix. <laughs> Cars, a few thousand. Motorcycle, replace. Gotta love Traxxas. That's why they do it. I got one. I broke a bulkhead last time I brought it out here. It's an E Revo 2. <clears throat> yeah, I didn't know it. Have it on my shelf. I was like, oh, I'm gonna take this out, go to pick it up, and the front end just kind of like falls apart. I'm like, oh man, I really don't want to replace the bulkhead. That's not something I keep in my toolbox. So. But, you know, I got more of them to keep me busy, so. Eventually I'll get to it. I'll be like, man, I really need to run that thing. I'm more, I'm more of a nitro guy. I get, I get more. Yeah. Well, electrics or brushless, whatever you want to call it. There's brushed and brushless. Those, uh, those seem to be a little bit more. All together, when you get them, you just plug them in and play like this. Yeah. Nitros, eh? You gotta you gotta tune the engine. Yeah. I used to have one. Yeah. 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 Unless you like to dick with things all the time yeah. and you us to do this and that. Yeah, for sure. I like the simplicity of these ones. Yeah, they're... This one, I mean, yeah, okay. It's all right. <laughs> it's the first time I really drove it, so... Just need to get it on some rocks. Yeah. It bounces a lot, though drop it on the ground it'll bounce and flip over it's not it's not like the monster trucks those I like because they go fast they jump high and they keep going yeah yeah 10 skill or the 8 skill yeah I think they yeah Yep. Yeah, that one I got over there, that runs on a 6S battery. That thing's crazy fast. Well, I bet. <clears throat> I, I haven't even got the... I think I can go to the 2S with my e Revo. You got the little e Revo or the no, big I one? I the 10s. Oh, you can... Hmm, is it brushless or is it brushed, you know? It's brushed. Yeah? Oh, heck, you can run 4S on that guy. Oh yeah. Yeah, from what I was told, I think it was two Yeah, those the speed controls and the motors. It's got two motors, right? Yeah. Yeah, the speed control and the motors. It they're they're rated for 4S. Really? Yeah. Now, what I guess I don't understand about the motors, one's reverse and one's not, so I don't know how that works. Cause if you hit it forward, it's got to be putting all the power from two motors in there. Yeah. It must just be the way it's set then. I think I think it's just the way they wired up. If you get a motor that's on the back side and a motor on the front side, they're going to be going different directions, yeah. you know. But if you get them on the opposite side of the spur gear, it might be different. I don't know how they're set up exactly. I've never had one. I've always had just single motors. <clears throat> Other than this thing, but this thing don't count because it's got independent axles. So. Definitely not a speed freak, is it? I bet it'll climb good on some rocks. It don't like the dirt much. Yeah, I watched all sorts of videos and this and that and the other before I actually went to pot stuff. 
Yeah. There was a lot of cool shit. Yeah, I got all these fist skills. Oh! Got all these fist skills out now and stuff. Yeah. I think they're... 